It's an ordinary passenger plane with ordinary engines, but there's nothing ordinary about what's going in the tank. This aircraft is about to be the world's first commercial plane to fly across the Atlantic, both engines powered completely by sustainable aviation fuel. This isn't a zero emission flight, but it absolutely is demonstrating that we have huge levers out there and huge opportunities to materially bring down the carbon footprint of flight today. Currently, commercial flying accounts for up to 3% of global carbon emissions. Sustainable aviation fuel, or SAF, is a potential solution, made up of elements like cooking oil, agricultural waste and even algae. Globally, though, just 0.1% of fuel in planes is currently SAF, meaning there's a long way to go to reach the UK's jet zero target by 2050. The good thing about sustainable aviation fuel is that any plane engine can use it. The downside of the fuel coming out of these tankers today is that it's really expensive to produce and requires a huge amount of raw material. But the alternatives, such as battery power and even hydrogen fuel, are decades from being viable, especially for long haul. Other airlines like Emirates and BA are also experimenting with sustainable aviation fuel and agree it's the best option for now. The government, though, is about to cap the amount of SAF going into this record-breaking plane, believing it should be prioritised for cars and lorries. It's a well-intentioned flight that's been poorly executed, and it's been poorly executed because of the fuel that's going into the plane. The fuel that's going in just simply is not sustainable. This plane then just one step towards making flying fit for the future.